when I first read the show, I'm not usually like reading a, a play kind of person, but I I just couldn't put it down because I was like reading through it and it just screamed Miyazaki design to me. Just everything that I love about all of those movies uh, kind of came out in that show or while reading through it the first time. So I, I really wanted to add that kind of like, it's almost like a handmade element to it. Um, and then Richard started talking to me about how he wanted it to be very much, you know, these people's story and um, kind of the handmade element to that as well. So I really wanted to, I really wanted to make it these these uh, characters specific story, and this is exactly what happened to them, and this is exact all of the the wonder and the mysticism that kind of goes with that, and then all of the um, the kind of confusion and the terror that they also experience uh, as they go throughout the whole show. Um, currently, my favorite thing I've worked with uh, would have to be. Um, Naja's theme that uh, that comes in when the goddess is ever on stage. There's this kind of, uh, I want to fill the space with something that adds a little bit of presence to what she's doing. Um, but we're also going to mic her in a way that's going to um, also help with filling the presence of the space. Uh, the thing I'm looking forward to the most, though, is definitely uh, Zyklo. I'm looking to, to play with that. I'm going to play with his voice, and we're going to scare the crap out of some people, and it's going to be awesome. So I'm really excited. <laughs> In my design and in my theme and stuff like that, I've really tried to, um, uh, w well, we have a couple different levels. We've got the, the basic instruments that we have, um, which are all uh, percussion kind of based instruments that are built out of things that I've found around. Uh, like we have a tire drum and we have a couple of drums. One of them is a water bottle and stuff like that. So it's, it's a whole bunch of like really garbage kind of things like that. Um, but they, they mean a lot to these characters, the, these refugees. It's, it's what they have, it's what they've come to use. So they, um, they hold on to these things and it's really important for them. So we have this music that they've kind of created out of their different cultures um, to play on these instruments that they have. But then uh, when, you, when you look away from that, uh, when we look at the grand scheme of the whole show, I want to throw these people immediately into these environments and I want to, I, I want to make them more than realistic. I want to make them a nice like heightened level where we start to feel for these characters and the situations that they go through, but um, not that we're trying to recreate, you know, every plate in the closet, but um, when a bomb goes off, I want to shake the place.